And welcome back to the Two Minute Warning Cigar Review, Cole's Nose version of what we did today. Today on the Cigar Dungeon Podcast, we smoked the Alec Bradley Black Market paired with the Jack Daniels Bonded Alec Bradley Black Market made number six in Cigar Ficinano's Top 25 Cigars of 2022. And the Jack Daniels Bonded made number one Whiskey of the Year in the Whiskey Advocate by the same publishers. A wildly unheard of magazine. <laughs> Today on the podcast, we looked at the best high school movies on a ranker list. To hear what we thought about this disappointing ranker list, go listen to the podcast on Spotify or wherever you listen to your podcasts. And that was all based off the fired up words of Seth Rogen when he said that a teen movie has not been made as well as Superbad. Sure. You know how we do on the Cigar Dungeon podcast, 40 seconds up on the clock each are you ready, Marty? I am. All right, so start it. Okay, so we're getting into the black market. Honestly, <clears throat> this is not an unfamiliar cigar to any of us. Um, the fact that it placed high on this ranking for this list, uh, maybe this year's crop was a little bit better than the last or the previous, whatever it was. Sometimes that happens with big uh, brands. Man, it's definitely firing on all cylinders. It's very smooth. It's got a little bit of fieriness to it. Not a ton of like pepper or something that's gonna bash out the, the novice. But it's very good, very rich, very hearty. Uh, with this whiskey, man, it, it definitely is a little bit of fire. You definitely need a cue, but it's got those cherry connotations and those notes. They pair very, very, very well. Are you ready, James? Yeah. The Bonded Jack Daniels Tennessee Whiskey is a fantastic whiskey. It starts off way too strong to drink, but in those notes, you're finding sweetness. You're finding those cherry notes, those caramel notes, the spice. Uh, it hits way too hard. You got you to bring that down with a cube, I would say for sure, or water it down, or maybe even blend this into your favorite mixed drink. Who knows? It paired amazingly with the Black Market Cigar. The Black Market is a fan favorite around here. We, we've always come back to it. It's one of those unique cigars where you're going to get a flavor that no other cigar brings to your table. So it's always worth having. It's always worth trying. I particularly love finding out that the notes that we're tasting are those Panama tobaccos. Today on the podcast, the Black Market did not disappoint. Like James said, that Panamanium tobacco is absolutely unique and really makes this cigar. Uh, I would not recommend this cigar for the novice. It is a very full, powerful cigar, but to the experienced cigar smoker, you're really gonna pick out those really nice, unique notes. Um, the Jack Daniels Bonded, although I disagree with this being a whiskey of the year, it is a very good whiskey, especially for the price point. The novice could try this out, but it is gonna burn out your vocal cords. Definitely do need the ice cube in this. I do not recommend this to even the experienced whiskey drinker without that ice cube. That being said, smoke good cigars, drink good booze, eat good food. Cheers. 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 Hey, Emma. Huh? What a great.